praise the Lord and we greet you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. We are so elated that you have chosen to spend your Sunday worship experience with us. On behalf of our pastor and first lady, the ministers and members of Beulah Refuge Tabernacle and First Refuge of Barnwell, we say welcome. Service will begin momentarily. We invite you to like and share this live stream service at this time. We also invite you to be active in the comments to give praises to our Lord, encouraging to the worship leaders and the man of God as he brings forth the word on this morning. feet and give the Lord a hand clap praise in the house on this morning for his goodness and his mercy come on let us clap our hands and give the Lord a hand clap praise for his goodness and his mercy his love his kindness and his grace be shown toward Hallelujah. us at this time we have our standing prayer and scripture in Jesus name we have come into this house to gather in his name to work Hallelujah, we have come into this house to gather in to worship it. Hallelujah. Prayer scripture from my deacon Chris Baxter. 
Oh, heaven of Father, Lord Jesus. I want to thank you, Lord. Allow me, Lord, to see this day, Lord. I want to thank you, Lord Jesus, for dying on the cross for me. I want to thank you, Lord Jesus, that things in my life is not always right, Lord. But Father, help me, Lord, to keep my mind on you, Lord. There's time, Father. I need to repent all the time, Lord Jesus. All the time. Because, Father, I don't want to let nothing slide. I don't want to let anything that is not of you, Lord Jesus, that I can ask you, Father, to help me with. Help those in the nursing home, Lord. Those that who laying in the bed, Lord Jesus, that can find to the bed. Those that can't get up and wash themselves or feed themselves, Lord Jesus. Help the young people that walk around, Lord, feeling that they're here above everything. You don't have to listen to the parents. You don't have to get out and worry. They want you to do it all. But Father, put us in the right state of mind, Lord Jesus. Even pray for those that are in the war, those who protect in our nation, Lord Jesus those first responders those that who left Christ Lord Jesus make a way Lord Jesus that you can turn them around make a way Lord Jesus that let them feel that kill with the word that once was ahead of their life now they find the time to, to go and a lot of gag out in the street Father, help that mother that don't have the support. Help that father that if the wife or the, the missus is not around, help him, oh Lord Jesus, to see the right way. Lord, if we stumble, Lord Jesus, help us to stand, Lord. Help us to get up and look and see what you've done for us. Even the things that we forgot, Lord Jesus. Those that don't have food on the table, Lord. How to pay the bill. Help them, Lord. Make a way, Lord Jesus. Give us strength, Lord. That we always see your name, Lord Jesus. And give your name the praise. Amen. Amen. Our scripture, we got a short one today. Our scripture be coming from Galatians, the first chapter, at the first verse, at the third verse, grace and peace to you from God, our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ, who gave himself for our sin to rescue us from the present evil a calling to his will of God and God, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. We thank God for the reading of the word that we might not just hear us, but doers of the word of God. Amen. We give God praise on this morning for his goodness and his mercy, and his love and his kindness. I love to praise him. 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 Oh, I love to praise His holy name. I love to praise Him. I love to praise His name. I love to praise Him. I love to praise Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
time he has done. He has done great things. He's done mighty great things. He has done great things. Yes, you are. Hallelujah. He's worthy to be praised. We magnify the name of Jesus. He's an awesome God and greatly to be praised. Hallelujah. He's an awesome and wonderful Lord. We thank him for his goodness and his mercy and his grace that he bestowed upon us each and every day. Amen. God is a good God. Yes, he is. Oh, the Lord is high above the heavens. The Lord is high above oh, the oh, heavens. And his glory above the nation. And his glory oh, above oh, the nation. Oh, the Lord is high above the heavens. The Lord is high oh, above oh, the heavens. And his glory above the nation. And his glory yeah, above yeah, the nation. Yeah, the Lord is high Lord above the heavens. The Lord is high above Oh, and his glory above the nation. And his glory yeah, above the nation. Yeah, the Lord is high above the heavens. The Lord is high above the heavens. Oh, and his glory above the nation. And his glory yeah, above the nation. Yeah, the Lord is high above the heavens. The Lord is high above the heavens. Oh, and his glory above the nation. And his glory yeah, above the nation. Yeah, the Lord is high above the heavens. The Lord is high above oh, the heavens. Oh, and his glory above the nation. And his glory above the nation. Give out the highest praise that of God's people say halle, 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 halle,
door opener, the keeper of my mind, the deliverer of my soul, my savior, my redeemer, my Lord, Lord of Lords, you are God, Elohim, Jehovah Jireh, El Shaddai, yes you are, Glory provider, wonderful, Christ. 
So every situation belongs to Jesus. Every problem belongs to Jesus. Every sickness belongs to Jesus. Because it's all been done on the yes. cross at Calvary. How I many know glory and honor God, great God? Come on, everybody, don't sit down because it's going to be our last song. Come on, clap your hands. The musicians going to get it together in a minute because we ain't singing in a long time. God, great God, glory and honor, dominion and power. He is Jehovah. Worthy. Hallelujah, he's our God. Come on, clap your hands, everybody. Come on, clap your hands, everybody. Come on, everybody. Come on, come on, come on. Let's feel the silence with our great voice. Come on, everybody, put your hands together. Glory and honor, dominion and power, now and forever, the Lord God omnipotent reigneth with power, forever with power, greater than all you are, sovereign God, God, great God, worthy of honor and glory, we stand here in reverence, blessed in your presence, Jehovah. And honor, dominion, and power, now and forever, the Lord God omnipotent reigneth with power, forever with power, greater than all you are, sovereign God, God, great God, worthy of honor and glory, we stand here in reverence, blessed in your presence, Jehovah. Nobody greater. 
us. Come on, clap your hands and give God a good praise. Thank you, Jesus. Look at your neighbor and say, he is Lord Jehovah. Yes, sir. Hear ye, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I bless the wonderful name of God today. Amen. He has declared that Jehovah is his name. He is Lord Jesus Christ. Jehovah God. There is no other, none to be compared with him. None that can equal to him. There is no other God but our God. And he is Lord Jehovah. Let the church say amen. amen. We certainly bless the Lord today. We do magnify and exalt that wonderful name, Lord Jesus Christ. For at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that he is Lord. We bless the Lord. We certainly give honor to all of our ministry or brethren and presence of our speaker this morning. Amen. Assistant Pastor Ella Kelsey Mag. Assistant Pastor Willie C. Hampton, to all of our deacons, our mothers, our church mother, Mother Dunning, to First Lady Mother Smith, and to all the mothers and in their absence, and we bless the Lord for each and every one of you that are assembled here today, today in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We bless God and we praise him for his goodness and mercy. Now, we want you to be reminded as a, of today, this afternoon, uh, for the service in Barnwell, uh, we have asked Minister Hezekiah Tenley to be the speaker, and uh, we're looking forward to that. I know he is also, and I'm asking as many of you all that can go to please go on this afternoon. If you're not here in Beulah on this morning, find a way to get to Barnwell on this afternoon to be in the service there. We're looking forward to a glorious time. Looking forward to a glorious time here in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. For where the Spirit of the Lord is, the Bible declared there is liberty. And in his presence is the fullness of joy. And at his right hand there are pleasures evermore. I do bless the Lord and we praise him so uh, come and go. Elder Hampton has said that he will be driving the bus uh, to Bonwell on this afternoon. We want to leave from our house, from the Smith's home at 3.30 on this afternoon. So make your way there. I've uh, got plenty of parking space for you to park your car. Uh, come in and join us uh, for the fellowship in Barnwell. We're looking for some of the saints from uh, Refuge Orangeburg and uh, United. I'm not sure whether they're going to be there, but we're looking for them uh, to join us in service there in Barnwell on this afternoon. Amen? All right. God bless you. We bless the Lord and we do praise him for all of you and for what God is doing in your lives. I want you to remember our mother Payne. She's still recuperating from her surgery of on last Monday. And so let's keep her in our prayers and everyone else who may need the prayers of the righteous because the Bible declare that the prayers of the righteous availeth much. And we bless the Lord. I know the scripture says a, a righteous man, but we he know talking about righteous woman too. Amen. All the righteous people of God, my God, their prayers avails much. In Jesus' name. Amen. All right. At this time, Sister Huggins is going to give us our offertory directions, and we will follow suit after that.
He is Lord. He is Lord. Every knee shall bow. Every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Lord, you are God and there is no other we bow before you, we worship you, we praise you. We magnify you for your goodness and your mercy. Lord, you've been a good God. You've been a good father, a good provider, a good way maker, a good door opener. Our hearts rejoice and are made to be glad. Father, now as your people come to give a portion of what you have blessed them, with of the coffers of heaven. I pray now, God, that you would cause the spirit of thanksgiving and joy to overshadow them, knowing that the Lord loveth the cheerful giver. Bless now, Father, both the gift and the giver, and we will glorify, magnify, and exalt your wonderful name. For it is in the name, Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Let us come on the directions of our ushers. Praise the Lord, everybody, and welcome to Beulah Refuge Tabernacle, 469 Landfill Road, where you are always welcome here in Jesus' name. Don't forget on this afternoon, we're traveling to Barnwell Refuge Temple, First Refuge, amen, Barnwell this afternoon at 4.30 p.m. on today. Also remember, our Bible study is going to be on Wednesday night at 7.30 p.m. In the month of May, upcoming events, Mother Daughter Banquet, May 11th, amen. Don't forget our Mother Daughter Banquet, May 11th. Also, on May 19th, it's Missionary Rally Day here in Beulah Refuge Tabernacle. We, we believe we gave out all of the um, rally sheets on last week to see whose team you are on. So please pay close attention to your rally day sheet. Also on the 25th of May, it's the South Carolina Upstate Ministers and Deacon Wives Guild rally day here in Orangeburg at United Church at 1 p.m. I believe that's all of our immediate announcements. Remember to pray one for another, as our pastors already mentioned. If you're watching Sister P Mother Payne, speedy recovery, amen, on today. Our Sister Glorine, remember to pray also for her, her and all the others that we may not know of. Pray one for another. I pray for you, and you pray for me, and we're going to watch God change things. Amen. Y'all be sure to join us for two Wednesday night Bible class. We'll be teaching on the subject, the infallible word of God. Amen. So let's pay it, let's join in on Wednesday night.
Somebody said, Lord, have your way. Somebody said, Lord, have your way. Somebody said, Lord, have your way. <laughs> yeah, somebody said, Lord, have your way. Glory. We can't do nothing. We can't do nothing. Until the Holy Ghost show up. <laughs> you can't do nothing until the Holy Ghost show up. Yeah. Yeah. Lord, have your way. Somebody standing in the need of prayer. Somebody to give him some praise somebody said he's worthy he's worthy to be praised thank you jesus yeah The devil thought he had me. <laughs> Tell your neighbor the devil thought he had me. <laughs> but I got away. <laughs> Come on and give us some praise. I think somebody has come to have some church. Glory. Satan on your track. Trying to turn you back. <laughs> But I got away. Oh, yeah. Somebody said, the Lord got me out. Come on, y'all got to talk to me this morning. Said, the Lord gave me a way of escape. Oh, y'all don't hear me. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Come on, talk to your neighbor. Tell your neighbor. 
why should I be bound? Come on, talk to your neighbor. Talk to your neighbor and say, why should I be bound? <laughs> Jesus <laughs> has set me free. He said, where the spirit of bishop, where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. How many got the Holy Ghost in here today? Come on and praise him. Because Jesus <laughs> has set me free. Free in my mind. Free in my spirit. I feel the power of the Holy Ghost here this morning. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes. You ought to praise him. You ought to praise your way out. Tell your neighbor, I know you're having a rough time, but you ought to praise your way out. Yeah. yeah. Somebody says, send Judah first. Send Judah first. Oh, y'all don't hear me. Judah means praise to God. Send Judah first. Come on, tell your neighbor. Send you the first. I almost feel like preaching. Preach, Elder. Yeah. The devil's been on my back. Preach, Elder. But I'm here, to, amen, to announce victory. Preach, Lord. Mother Smith, thanks be unto God, which always <laughs> causes us to triumph in Christ. God said, always. Always. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Tell your neighbor, I'm coming out of this. <laughs> I don't know what your this is, and I know some of it too. But I'm coming out. Coming out. <laughs> I'm coming out with my hand up. <laughs> because that's a victory sign. You ought to get your hands up, Beulah. Raise your hands up and get a praise in your mouth. Oh, yes. He said, I will restore what the cracker worm and the pommel worm have stole from you. The years that he stole from you. I want it all back. <laughs> I want the first thing, my health back. <laughs> the second thing is I want my, my money back. <laughs> Come on and give God some praise up in here. Oh, yes. I'm glad. I'm glad. Talk to your neighbor. I'm glad this thing don't depend on me. <laughs> oh, y'all didn't hear me. I'm glad this don't depend on me. For in him we live and move and have our beings. Oh, yes. Come on, give me some praise. Yeah, the devil counted you out, but look at you. You ought to take a look at yourself in the mirror. Say, I don't look like what I've been through. Come on, give me some praise. Oh, y'all don't want to have no church. But I know what I've been through. I've been through hell and high waters, but God was with me to strengthen me through it. Amen. And to bring me out of it. You want to give him some praise in here this morning? Oh, yes. I feel my helper already. <laughs> oh, yes. You want to tell your name of Jesus has already showed up. Oh, yes. Give him the glory. Give him praise. Amen. Tell your neighbor. Tell your neighbor. He's already here. Come on. Talk to your neighbor. Jesus is already here. I feel like preaching. He's already here. We don't have to wait till he come. He's already here. Oh, yes. Come on, give him some praise up in here. Yeah. We reverence the spirit of the Lord. We give double honor to our beloved bishop, Bishop David Ephesus. Come on, let's give the Lord a praise for the man of God of this house. Amen. And, 
and to our um, shepherd, Mother Smith, and to our Elder Hampton, and to the precious mothers, and to all the lovely people of God. Come on, give yourself a praise. You somebody. Yes, you somebody. Come on, talk to yourself. I'm somebody. Come on, give, give him some praise. Say, God made me somebody. You're a peculiar people. You're a holy nation. Come on, give God some praise. He said, you shall show forth the praise of him. Oh, yes. Amen. Thank God for the Jews. But I ain't no Jew. But I'm a Gentile. Been called into the family of God. You ought to give God some praise that he called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. <laughs> Look where he brought us from. Come on, give us some praise. He brought us out of darkness. He went in into his marvelous light. And thank God he has. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Look with us briefly. Jeremiah, the 33rd chapter. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Yeah, my soul. Glory. Jeremiah, the 33rd chapter and the first verse. Moreover, the word of the Lord came unto Jeremiah the second time. And while he was yet shut up in the court of the prison, saying, This says the Lord, the maker thereof, the Lord that formed it to establish it. The Lord is his name. Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. I would like to leave a thought with you on this morning. How long, O oh Lord? How long, O oh Lord? And my subtopic is Call unto me. Thank you, Jesus. And I will answer thee, says the Lord. Come on, give the Lord a big shout out. He said, call unto him, and he will answer you, and show thee great and mighty things. For this says the Lord, the God of Israel, Concerning the houses of the city and the houses of the king of Judah that were torn down to make a defense against the siege mounts and against the sword. Jeremiah is telling the king of Judah that they are coming in to fight against the Chaldeans and to fill them with the dead bodies of men whom I shall strike down in my anger and my wrath. For I have hid my face from the city because of all their evil. Here he gives a promise to the house of Judah 
And he says, Behold, I will bring it health and healing. I will heal them and reveal to them prosperity and security. And I will cause the captivity of Israel to return and build them at first. God is giving hope to his people, even though the judgment they are enduring is brought about by their own refusal to repent. How long, O oh Lord? The psalmist said, How long will thou forget me, O oh Lord, forever? How long will thou hide thy face from me? How long shall I take sorrow in my heart daily how long shall my enemies be exalted over me consider and hear me O oh lord my god lighten my eyes least i sleep the sleep of death least my enemies say I have prevailed against him. And those rejoiced when I moved. Those who expect to receive comfort from God must call upon him for his name is a strong tower and the righteous runneth therein and is safe. He said, call upon me and I will answer thee and show thee great and mighty things. It is the promise to those that are in long sorrows shall again be filled with joy and he will give all needful supplies. He said, no good thing will he withhold from them that walk uprightly before him. Long sorrows. If you haven't had that experience yet, just live a little bit longer. Come on, tell your neighbor, just live a little bit longer. And you too will have situations that will take you through great troubles like you've never seen before. And you will question, where is God? And Job said, I searched for him. And I couldn't find him. I looked to my right and my left. And I said, behold, where is God? And I could not find him. But he knows the way that I take. <laughs> and when he has tried me, I shall come forth as pure gold. Come on, give God some praise. Thank you, Jesus. Come forth as pure gold. All of his friends forsook him. They stay with him. For about seven days, they tore their mantle, tore their clothes, and they fasted and prayed and got down with Job in ashes and sackcloth. And they saw that his suffering was great, for he had boys of soil on the top of his head to his feet. 
He had lost 10 children all at one time. He was in a moment of long sorrow. But God had not forsaken Job. He has said in the beginning of the book of Job to Satan, have you considered my servant Job? And he said, yes, I saw him when I was going to and fro in the earth. But I couldn't get to him because you had a head around him. Thank you, Jesus. What do you do when God takes the heads from around you? Well, this man, Job, he even cursed the day that he was born. Oh, yes. Don't knock him because you hadn't been through what he has been through. You don't know what you're going to do when you go through your long sorrows. You will say a lot of things that you thought you wouldn't say. But since God is a faithful God, I feel like preaching. <laughs> amen. He, amen. He says to put on the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. Oh, yes. And that'll take you for a while. But you got to have the word in you. And David said, that word have I hid in my heart that I might not sin against God. Amen. And the psalmist said, unless the Lord had been my delight, I would have perished in my affliction. <laughs> oh, yes. His word is a lamp to my feet. And a light to my pathway. Somebody said, thank God for his word. Oh, yes. His word is still standing strong in the midst of all the violence in the land. His word is still standing strong. Oh, yes. Amen. How do you know his word is still active in the earth? Well, we still see, amen, the ordinance of heaven and earth. Oh, yes, we still see the sun rising and, the, amen, the moon at nighttime. Oh, yes, that lets us know that God's word is still active in the earth. I wish I had a praying church. <laughs> but here is Jeremiah and in the prison, amen, and here he's preaching the truth. And every time he preaches the truth, he gets in trouble. Oh, yes. Amen. But he had a word for them in the house of Judah. Amen. That the Chaldeans are coming to take you as prisoners. Oh, yes. But amen. When you're in, amen, captivity. Oh, yes. He said, call upon me and I will answer you and show thee great and mighty things. Though it's long sorrow. Oh, yes. Long sorrow. Amen. Amen. But God will never leave us nor forsake us. I wish I had a praying church. Oh, yes. You remember John the Baptist who was born with the Holy Ghost? Who was born with the Holy Ghost. Amen. And he was born, amen, filled with the Spirit of God. And yet he got discouraged in his in his suffering, his long suffering. Amen. He was sitting there in the prison, lonely. Amen. He could not see the works of the Savior. Amen. No more. He became discouraged. Oh, yes. He became discouraged. And you know the story. He calls for his disciples. Amen. To go and see whether this Jesus is the one. Is he the Messiah? Is he the Savior? Oh, yes. I almost feel like preaching. And here he says, Amen. Thou art he that should come. Uh, look we for another. 
And in that same hour, he cured many of their infirmities. Jesus did. And plagues and evil spirits. And unto many that were blind, he gave sight. Oh, yes. This is John the Baptist. Amen. Jesus said, tell John, saying to his disciples, what things you have seen and heard, how that the blind see and the lame walk and the lepers are cleansed and the deaf hear and the dead are raised. Oh, yes. You, amen. You ought to tell your neighbor that Jesus is the one. Oh, yes, he is, amen, the chosen one. Oh, yes, he is God himself in the flesh, manifested, amen, he is surely God, amen. Emmanuel means, amen, God with us. Oh, yes, I to give God some praise that he is God with us. Oh, yes. Thank God for that knowledge. You ought to tell your neighbor, thank God for that knowledge. Amen. That God is with us in our long sorrows. Oh, yes. Amen. Ain't nobody like him. Oh, yes. Not your mama, not your daddy. Ain't nobody like Jesus. I praise his name, but here he's the God of all comfort. Amen. In all trials, in all tribulations, he knows how to comfort us. Oh, yes. He knows how to whisper sweet words into our spirit, man, laying in our bed at night. He talks with me. He walks with me uh, upon life narrows journey. Uh, oh, the joy that I know oh, uh, when he found me through his loving arms all around me. Uh, you ought to give God some praise in here today. Amen. You ought to, amen, be confident in this God that if you call his name, he hears your prayer. Uh, and he will eventually, amen, answer. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, he says that you are more valuable than the sparrows. Amen. Amen. You are more valuable, valuable than the sparrows. Yeah. Uh, amen. Amen. Two. Amen. The sparrows are worth one penny. Yeah. He said, you're far more valuable than many sparrows. Uh, amen. He made the lilies of the field. Amen. He decorated everything because he's God. Uh, amen. If he provided these things, amen, and showed us, amen, that he will supply all your need according to his riches in glory. Uh, I feel like preaching, uh, but I'm here to let you know I'm talking to those that are in long sorrow. Uh, amen. You ask the question, Lord, how long, oh Lord? Uh, come on, talk to your neighbor. Uh, if you're not in long sorrow, don't ask your neighbor. But if you are, said, Lord, uh, how long, oh Lord? Uh, oh, yes. Uh, you feel forsaken. You feel less than kicked to the curb but it's just a feeling you ought to tell your neighbor everything is gonna be all right feelings come and feelings go but because god has given them a promise i will bring it to health i will cure it oh yes you ought to give god some praise he said i will send prosperity uh, oh yes with truth and peace uh, and it's the peace of God uh, that passes all understanding uh, it guards your heart uh, and it guards your mind uh, thank God for the peace of God 
Uh, you ought to give God some praise. Uh, when I think uh, on the goodness of God uh, and all he's done for me, uh, my soul uh, breaks out in a praise. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, what shall we render uh, unto the Lord for all of his benefits? Uh, what you going to say to God? Uh, he has bless you in your going out uh, and you're coming in uh, you ought to give us some praise uh, oh yes uh, his name is great uh, and he is greatly uh, to be praised uh, I think that went over somebody head uh, but he is great uh, and he's greatly uh, to be praised uh, oh yes at the suffering of Christ bound in us uh, so the consolation also aboundeth by Christ uh, you ought to give God some praise uh, the more the times get rough uh, oh yes and the hills are hard to climb uh, oh yes he gives you more comfort uh, he gives you more consolation uh, because he's a faithful God to his word uh, you ought to give God some praise uh, you know what they said uh, oh yes uh, amen when Lazarus died oh yes uh, Amen. Jesus uh, want to show uh, a greater glory. Uh, so he's got to take you beyond uh, what he's already done. Uh, he's already healed many sick folks. Uh, but in this case, uh, he had friends called Mary and Martha and Lazarus. Uh, and the Bible says he loved them. Oh, yes. Uh, but when they requested for him to come uh, off his preaching, amen, mission, uh, he delayed, amen, their answer, their question, their request. Uh, he stayed in Bethany, amen, amen, until he got word that Lazarus had died. Uh, so you know the story when Jesus showed up. Uh, oh, yes, how Mary and Martha amen how they were hurt that their friend didn't show up to heal their brother uh, but I'm here to let you know you can always have onlookers uh, they always looking at you in your long suffering uh, and the onlookers said could not uh, amen Jesus heal the Lazarus and to keep him from dying uh, oh yes but we are here to answer that question uh, surely he could have healed his body if he wanted to uh, oh yes but he wanted to show them a greater side of himself uh, amen that he can be amen four days late according to our time uh, but according to the divine time he's right on time uh, and whenever he shows up uh, Amen. You know the story. He shows up and calls Lazarus' name, saying, Come forth, Lazarus. Uh, amen. And the man, after they removed the stone, he came forth hopping uh, in grave clothes. Uh, you ought to give God some praise. Uh, amen. That same Jesus, uh, oh yes, that healed then and brought that man from death. Uh, he's the same. Same Jesus today, he can still raise the dead, uh, he can still heal all diseases. Uh, oh, yes, you ought to give God some praise. Uh, amen. I'm so glad that I got Jesus on my side. Uh, you ought to give God some praise up in here. Uh, oh, yes, he's a good God. Uh, ain't nobody like Jesus. 
when mother and father forsake you, uh, then the Lord will take you up. Uh, I wish I had a praying church, uh, but I'm so glad I know his name. Uh, his name is powerful and it's above every name that is named. Uh, amen. Even the devil trembles at his name. Uh, his name is Jesus. Uh, thank God for that name. Uh, somebody said, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Uh, if you want the Holy Ghost, uh, just keep calling on that name. Uh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Uh, oh, yes, if you need comfort, uh, amen, it's in his name. Uh, give him some praise up in here. Uh, I wish I had a praying church. Uh, but look at here. Uh, amen, the psalmist said uh, that God has magnified his word uh, above his very name name uh, oh yes his name uh, amen his word uh, amen his commandments are exceedingly broad uh, that means his word fits every case uh, every situation uh, you can find it in the word uh, oh yes uh, thank God uh, for amen for amen Romans 15 and 4 uh, oh yes what is written whatsoever things are written uh, for time uh, are written for our learning that we through patient and comfort of the scriptures uh, might have hope uh, somebody say get in the word and stay there uh, be ready uh, when Jesus comes uh, oh yes a four time meaning is uh, in a former time or uh, in the past uh, previously uh, for our learning uh, look here uh, when Moses and the Israelite got stuck at the Red Sea uh, and the pillar of cloud led them right there uh, and the mountains on the right and the Red Sea ahead uh, and Moses began to cry to God uh, amen and God told Moses uh, don't cry to me uh, use what you got uh, oh yes and Moses took the rod and you know the story stretched out it over the Red Sea uh, and the east wind blew all night long uh, oh yes <laughs> while Pharaoh and the armies came back to reclaim their slaves uh, but amen God had a pillar of fire in the rear uh, where they couldn't get to the children of God uh, because God has given them a promise uh, oh, y'all don't hear me. Uh, amen. They couldn't die before their time. Uh, oh, yes. They exit Egypt. Uh, they exit with the best. Uh, they exit with gold and silver. Uh, amen. Everything was healthy. They came out of Egypt. Uh, oh, y'all don't hear me. Uh, amen. Everything was healthy. Uh, their livestock was healthy. Uh, nothing was sick uh, nothing was crippled uh, oh yes uh, amen look at God uh, amen holding fast to his word uh, leading them with a pillar of cloud uh, oh yes but God uh, brought them through the Red Sea uh, I'm almost through I think uh, brought them through the Red Sea uh, amen and you know Pharaoh pursued them uh, and the amen the sea closed up on them uh, but the children of God made it to the other side uh, oh yes and it said Miriam uh, amen grab the tamarind uh, and begin to praise God uh, for he has amen thrown uh, the riders of Egypt uh, into the Red Sea uh, I wish I had a praying church uh, I'm so glad 
that God is able, amen, to do exceedingly abundantly above all that you ask or think. He can do it. No enemy is too great for God. You can't handle it, but God will fight your battle. That's what Mother Wright used to say. Let the Lord fight your battle for nobody fights like you. I'm so glad he's on my side. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivers them out of them all. Oh, yes. Give him some praise in the midst of long sorrow. Oh, yes. Look at the song this sang. If I had wings of a dove, I will fly away and be at rest from the stormy sea, from the tempest, from the trouble I'm in. But God, amen, got his hands on you. I wish I had a praying church. You want to tell your neighbor that God got his hands on you. Oh, yes. Now are we the sons of God. It shall not appear what we shall be, but we shall be like him. For we shall see him as he is. Thank God we are the children of God. We are the chosen ones along with the Jews. Oh, yes. You want to give God some praise. The devil can't win, but he's going to fight you because he's the devil. But we have a God that's greater than the devil. Greater is he that is in you than he that's in the world. You want to give God some praise? Oh, yes. Thank God. Amen. I can call on his name and he will answer. Thank God that he is God all by himself. Oh, yes. Though he slay me, yet will I trust him. Oh, yes. That's what Job said. Though he allow the devil to kill me, yet will I trust him. If he bring me to death, yet will I trust him. That should encourage us on our darkest days to call on him and he will answer. Come on, give him some praise. Oh, yes. When they were oppressed by King Sennacherib, they oppressed him without a cause. But I'm so glad that Isaiah gave them a word. Amen. That Sirikul shall not come to the borders of this nation. Oh, yes. Though he has defeated many nations and many gods, but he has never come up against the true and living God. Oh, y'all don't hear me. He is the first. He is the last. He's the beginning and he is the end. Give him some praise. Call on his name and he will answer you in his own time. Thank God that he is God. He told Moses, I am and that I am. Tell Pharaoh that I am God. 
Amen. Is going to deliver. Amen. His people out of Egypt. Thank God that he's the I am God right now. 2024. He's alive and well. No matter what. Amen. Happens in the White House. It don't matter who gets elected president. We've got a God that is faithful to his word and his children. Oh, yes. You know the temptation. Amen. It comes to destroy us. But God will make a way through the temptation that we might be able to bear. But he said, what is common to man? Oh, yes. Man experienced tsunamis. Man experienced earthquakes and many other things. But God will help us to bear it and to take us through it. Somebody ought to give him some praise. Oh, yes. Somebody ought to tell their neighbor the best is yet to come eyes have not seen ears have not heard the good things that he has in store for us come on give us some praise oh yes amen Joshua and King yeah, Joshua and Caleb, amen, went through, amen, the wilderness among all the plagues there. He saw the generation died off. They had 70 years and they died off. But Caleb and Joshua went over into the promised land. There is a promise that God has for you ha, but it's ahead ha, keep on going ha, i feel like pressing my way ha, because i know there's something better ha, it lies ahead ha, and when caleb got to amen ha, got to joshua say give me ha, this mountain where i spied out ha, Amen. According to the word of the man of God, Moses, uh, you know the story. Uh, amen. That Caleb uh, conquered the mountain, uh, defeated the giants there, uh, and conquered the mountain, uh, gave inheritance uh, to his daughters uh, and to his sons. Uh, you ought to give God some praise. Uh, you ought to tell your neighbor, uh, give me about five seconds. Ha, you ought to tell your neighbor, ha, blessed in, ha, you're going out, ha, blessed in, ha, you're coming in, ha, blessed in the city, ha, blessed in the field, ha, blessed amen, coming and going, ha, you just bless ha, if you hearken ha, to the voice of the Lord, ha, if you listen ha, to what he says. Said, ha, you just bless. Ha, amen. Tell your neighbor, ha, I'm just blessed. Ha. Oh, yes. Come on. Talk to your neighbor. Tell yourself, I'm just blessed. Ha. No matter what I'm going through, I'm blessed. Ha. Oh, yes. Give him some praise. Ha. Blessed be the God of our Father. Ha. Oh, yes. Ha. Who delivered us? Ha. He's the Father ha, of all mercy. How long, O oh Lord? He said, call upon me and I will answer thee and show thee great and mighty things. Thank you, Jesus. If you live, live to see it, your enemies will fall right before you. And you don't have to say nothing. Just be quiet. Sometimes it's, you got to be quiet. 
That way the enemy can't trail you. They can't head you off. Just be quiet. Because you're confident in your God. Oh, y'all Lord, hear me. You're confident in your past. Many have fallen that came up against you. And the, the new enemies that show up, they'll fall too. Give God some praise. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. I almost felt like dancing in here this morning. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, man. I don't know where he's at. And I ain't looking for him. <laughs> I like the new man better. Come on, give God some praise. Yeah, there may be one for salvation. There may be one for the Holy Ghost. God is pouring it out. He can refill again. Somebody said, I want some more. I want more of him. I want more of his spirit. I need more. I need more of God. Give it to me. I need more of God. Don't you need more of him? Give it to me, yeah. I'll share it. If there's a need in your life, Jesus said, He's available to give it 24 7. He's available. Give it to me. I'll be Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy give laden. It to me. He said, I'll give you rest. If there's a need in your Take life, my yoke upon me Jesus and learn of me. To give it to me. And he said, my burden is light. Come on. Give it to me. By faith. I'll bear it. The older Hampton was preaching last Sunday by faith. Give it to me. I'll it was through faith. Through faith that Sarah conceived, conceived the seed and bare the son because she had judged him faithful through faith. Give it to me, I'll bear it. Yes, Lord. Give it to me, I'll share it. Yes, Lord. If there's a need in your life, Jesus said, to give it Glory. to me, oh, give it to me, give it to me. The I'll Bible said, won't you give it to him? Suffer little children to come unto you, for I'll such is the kingdom of God. Father, in the name of your son, Jesus Christ, heal his body, touch him in a special way, in the name of Jesus, save him in his youth, in the time that he have allotted, bless him in a special way, do it for your glory and your honor, in the name of Jesus, Filled with the Holy Ghost. And we praise you for it. Jesus said, and it. To give it Jesus to me, oh, I surrender all. Oh, I. I surrender, I surrender all. Oh, 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 oh. Praise Him. Oh, Hallelujah. 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 Yeah. Praise you, the Lord. Do it for your glory and your honor. In Jesus' name. I surrender. Amen. Oh, glory. Oh, I surrender. Lord, I give it to you, Lord. Everything. I 
surrender. I surrender. to thee my blessed you're my blessed Savior Lord I surrender I surrender I surrender said, I cried in the ends of the earth, and he heard my cry. He pitied my bones and groaning. He heard me and delivered me. He died my God. Yes. I surrender everything to you, Lord. I leave it on the altar, Lord. I surrender. Yeah. Hallelujah. Everything to you. Somebody say glory. Somebody say glory. Here come my no money. Here come my seed of my co money. Here come my seed of my glory. Jesus. I feel like preaching. He said my co money. He done my so my cane. I'm my key. I'm my say. Hey, now my no money. Hey, come on. Send us help to the sanctuary. Save and fill with the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Somebody give him a praise. Somebody give him some glory. Somebody give him some honor. Somebody said, I reverence you, Lord. I reverence you. Magnify it. I saw I'm with you always. <laughs> he said, even to the end of the world, he come out no money. He'll show up. He's that type of savior to show up when you need him the most. He comes and shows himself strong and mighty. I wish I had a praying church. Come on, give us some praise. Somebody say glory. Somebody say glory. Come on, talk to him. Talk to Jesus. These are times where you got to talk to Jesus. I'm seeking, I'm seeking his word. He said, knock, and the door shall be open. <laughs> he says, seek, and you shall find. And everyone that asketh, receiveth. Come on, give me some praise. He said, everyone that asketh, receiveth. I feel like preaching. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. To the utmost, Jesus said, to the utmost. Here come my son. He said, where two or three Jesus are gathered said, together, he's here. Jesus is here. Somebody say the healer is here. I feel like preaching. The healer is here. And his name is Jesus. <laughs> his name is Jesus. I'm glad. I'm glad he's the greatest physician. I'm glad he's my healer. He come out no more say. 
He said, I will bring it to health and to cure. That's what the Lord told Jeremiah to tell him. I will bring it to health. I will bring it to prosperity and peace and truth. In Jesus' name. Already done. In Jesus' name. Through faith. Yeah, Elder Hemper said, through faith. Faith. They say we understand. He will pick you up. Say we understand. They say we understand that the worlds were framed through faith. <laughs> God spoke everything into existence. In the name of Jesus. Lord, thou knowest all things. Nothing can be hid from you. You know how to bless. You say, in all thy ways, acknowledge you. Come on, somebody help us. Say, in all thy ways, acknowledge you. And he will direct our path. In the name of Jesus. Do it for your glory. He will pick you up. Do it for your honor. Through faith. Turn your whole life. In Jesus' name. Yes, it's just that simple. Through faith. The size of a mustard seed. That's all I need. Through faith. Jesus. In Jesus' name. Shimmerite woman son had died laid in her laps and she told her husband it is well somebody will tell their neighbor it is well <laughs> with Bishop David Adam Smith it is well it is well somebody say it is well in Jesus' name, restore him the health. Restore, restore, Lord, and we'll praise you. And I know he'll praise you more. Restore in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In your precious name. In your precious name, and I my God, I must say, do it for your glory. Do it for your honor. In Jesus' name. Amen. Somebody say amen. Glory. Glory. We adore That's right. Come on, give the Lord a hand praise. Come on, give him some praise. Hallelujah. Somebody ought to give him some praise. We love him. We worship him in spirit and in truth because what he's done for us. When you see the condition of the world, you ought to say, thank God I'm saved. Thank you, Jesus. And men loving men and women loving women. And they're raising churn in their homes. 
Can you imagine the effect on those children? But the Lord still can save them. But it's got to be prayer. As Bishop was saying, the prayers of the righteous availeth much. Elijah prayed and said he was a man of like passion. He ate, he slept, he got tired. Everything, everything that men can experience. But he prayed that there won't be no dew, no rain. And God held back the rain. And after three and a half years, he prayed again and the rains returns. Somebody give God some praise. You know why the rain returned? Because Elijah had helped restore the worship. They had thrown Baal. They destroyed Baal altar and put God first. Come on, give God some praise. And then God, as a result, sent the rain to nourish the earth that the famine will be done away with. Thank you, Jesus. Isn't he awesome, God? His method, you got to follow his method. But we don't have a problem because we want deliverance. Stand on your feet if you're able to. Thank you. Um, just before you, a benediction, um, uh, thank God for the message. How long? Though he tarry, you wait. But he that cometh will come and will not tarry. Tell your, tell your neighbor, say, the moment he comes was the moment of your deliverance. God got it time. Thank you, Jesus. Let's remember at 3.30, we're meeting at, at our home to travel to Bonwell. Those of you that are riding on the bus, Elder Hampton will be at our home, leaving at 3.30. God bless you, Elder Mac. And we'll let that be the benediction. Amen. That word... That's what happened to Jeremiah. He said, I'm not going to make mention of his name no more. But that word was in him as a burning fire. <laughs> and he said he couldn't contain it. He had to preach. <laughs> oh, y'all Lord, hear me. He had to preach it. May the Lord watch between us while we're absent one from another. In Jesus' name. Let everyone say amen. So be it.